Hello, I'm Jack Herrick, and my life's mission is to give every single person on the planet a free practical education. So I'm doing that via a project called WikiHow. And for those who've been to WikiHow, who've never been to WikiHow, it's a how-to website which publishes hundreds of thousands of guides with simple step-by-step -step instructions on how to do pretty much anything. So to prepare for today, I read this article on how to give a speech. <laughs> it, it, you probably can't read from the back, but it basically says that public speaking is more scary than death. <laughs> but if I follow the 10 steps, I would survive. So if after five minutes I'm still here, you'll know WikiHow works. <laughs> so 13 years ago, fellow EHF fellow, Josh Hanna and I, had a problem. We wanted to start WikiHow, and we wanted to focus the company entirely on global impact, more than profit. And because we were not going to focus the company on profit, we couldn't successfully raise venture capital money, which is the normal kind of Silicon Valley model of starting a business. Meanwhile, all of our competitors took the opposite strategy, and they raised gobs of money. In fact, there was 15 different companies that each raised more than $10 million each. Collectively, these 15 companies raised an astounding $1 billion US dollars. We had zero dollars. <laughs> and I got to admit, it looked like we were not going to make it. But fast forward 13 years later, take those same 15 companies, chart them by audience size, and we're now number three on this list of 15. So how is this Cinderella story even possible? Well, it turns out we had four values that made our success possible. And in the time I've spent in New Zealand, I've discovered that Kiwis share these values, and Kiwi businesses, many Kiwi businesses also share these values. So I'd love to talk to you about them. Number one is purpose. WikiHow's purpose is really all about global impact. And we, that, that is clear in every decision we make at the company. Uh, and let me give you a few examples of that. Number one is all of our software is open source software. You can take all the software we've built over 13 years, download it, use it yourself, start your own company, start your own WikiHow competitor, whatever you want to do with it. Two, all of our content is Creative Commons licensed content. Three. We've translated WikiHow into 17 different languages, including many languages that we knew would never create a profit. And four, we've also figured out ways to distribute WikiHow to the millions of people around the world who cannot afford internet access. WikiHow value number two, people. So when you run, it turns out all employees want to work for a company that has a noble purpose. And as a result, WikiHow has been lucky enough to attract the very best talent in Silicon Valley. I've started four companies, and this one, without any funding, has the best team of any of the companies I've ever worked with. I'd like to point out one other thing about our team. Uh, WikiHow, uh, or sorry, EHF fellow Tracy Chow has done some amazing work pointing out, pointing, uh, uh, showing to the world that Silicon Valley is incredibly unequal in terms of gender balance. WikiHow has, on the other hand, a gender-balanced team. WikiHow value number three, perseverance. Our goal has always been to educate every single person on the planet and to do, take as long as it takes to do that. So we think we're pretty much going to be here forever. As a result, we make very long-term decisions. And it shouldn't be a surprise that when you make long-term decisions, they tend to pay off in the long term. So an example of a decision is thinking about our stewardship of this planet. 10 years ago, WikiHow became the largest website to become an entirely carbon neutral company. And I'm proud to say we're still doing that. And many, many other web publishers have since followed that. Value number four, paced growth. We reject the idea of growth at all costs. And uh, 
most of our competitors have gone the opposite strategy and try and go for the go big or go home strategy. And I'm happy to say that most of them have ended up pretty much just going home. <laughs> so 13 years in, WikiHow now serves 200 million people a month. We're very, very proud of that. But we're also very aware of the fact that we're still leaving 97% of the planet unserved. With the time I'm going to spend in New Zealand, I'm going to reinvest in the four values I talked about and hope that together we can find a way to serve the remaining 97%. Thank you.